All right, so um, question arose on how you guys are going to actually work together on this, um, knowing that we are in quarantine. Uh, I do understand that it's not going to be the easiest thing to do to work together, um, and I and I want you guys to understand that um, this is going to be worth 50 points. If you guys put any type of effort into it as a group, you will get 50 points. Um, I want you guys to have some fun with this, and I want you guys to not worry about um, it needing to be perfect, uh, it needing to be you know done in the utmost greatest way. All right, um, it's more of you guys can can have have some fun putting together some uh, some some campaign posters. Um, so what I have here is Canva. So um, C A N V A dot com. Okay, you guys can log in, uh, create an account by using your school account. And what Canva does is actually allows you to create a poster. So as you can see here, I have started to uh, create a poster here. The cool thing about Canva is that it has templates. So if you come over here to the left um, and you are looking at templates, all right, you have all of these templates that you can go through. Now, some of them are free, some of them are not. Um, I'm not asking you to upgrade your um, Canva account. Okay, um, so, I mean, a wanted poster, um, you have all of these different things where you can um, look, and they're all done by black and white poster, music poster. You could even probably put um, maybe campaign poster in here. Okay, look. Okay, campaign, save the earth now, global warming. You have these, these templates that you can use if you would like, register to vote. Um, or what you can do is when you start off, you have over here where I'm at now is nothing. Okay, you are able to click on photos and put in voting. Uh, you can put in, um, you know, ports. And it will bring up photos that are uh, actually brought into already. Now, what you have to understand with this is that if you look here on the bottom right, this one's free. You start getting to these where it says pro. Those are not free, and those are for your upgraded uh, um, aspects. So be careful when you're when you're trying to add a photo. That sports team. You can click on just baseball. So if you wanted to do, let's say, uh, president or red, white, and blue. Um, patriotic stuff. Look, you've got some free ones, you've got some non-free ones. Um, so you have all this ability. Now if you want to add, let's say we want to add uh, this photo here. I don't know. We'll go with this guy right here. The American flag. Okay. So I added this. I want to take this out of here. Don't like it anymore. Okay. All you need to do is highlight the photo just like you would, and you can hit delete. It takes the photo away. Okay. Now I want to add this one. I just click on it and add that photo. All right. Now you have different positions and different effects that you can use throughout all of this too. So if you would like, you can click on position. You can do top, middle, bottom, left, and right. Uh, if you want to, you can click on um, the copy style of it. You can make it transparent if you would like. Okay. So if I wanted to, click off of that. Now I've made this somewhat transparent. I can make this bigger. Maybe bring the picture of my family in front of it. And look. You can see still us behind the American flag if you like. There, there's a bunch of different ways you can, you know, mess with this if you if you wanted to. Um, you can click on this picture 
and are, you know you can add links you can lock the picture in there you can duplicate the picture you're allowed to flip you can crop you can adjust it um, there are filters that you can put on here epic filter uh, gives you different um, aspects and you can do effects too now I haven't really gotten into the effects aspect of this but they have all of these um, these aspects where you can add a color mix to it um, but it asks you to connect because it's an app by uh, by photo mosh um, but I'm sure it's perfectly fine because what canva is is basically a uh, it, it's like an education slash um, uh, like creating your own um, cards and stuff like that website and and they'll print these out actually and give them to you so if you guys make a good one you might want to print it out but um you can see though you can add all these all these photos okay from from here if you would like uh, they have trending photos um, you got a bunch of different stuff all right so now you have elements and you can go to elements and you can you have a bunch of free elements you have grids um, if you wanted to search for icons, let's say uh, America, see what they have. Look, you have all of these things where you can add these to it. That's not uh, South America. Um, where you could use that's got Greenland, we got North. I guess they're going they're going with Americas, uh, continent-wise. But you can add these to it. Again, watch these because these become pro. Where you have to pay for it but um if you want to add one of those you basically just click on it and it adds it there okay so let's say we don't like this american flag in the background too much patriotism sorry pitch you can drag your you know your usa picture put it underneath here you can move stuff around okay um, so you can do stuff like that you can add text if you would like you can add headings um, you have font combinations if you would like you can add subheadings so let's say uh, um, I don't know Maybe that's my uh, my campaign heading. You hit add add heading here. Um, oh shoot, that was the search bar over here. So we can we can click over here. And say what America needs now is family, and you can you can move this however you want you can come up here and you can change the size of it if you'd like you can make it down to uh, 18 which is way too small but you can you change change stuff up to get it to a point where you can you can change the color of it back you know it's white the background's blue maybe you want to be a little bit more patriotic and add that to be red um, if you highlight this you are able to make it italic um, you can bullet point you can put lists so if you want to put together a a, a, a poster that has like I don't know let's say um, one, one of you guys wants to wants to run on the the fact of like um, environmental protection or like runner likes um, the, the science aspect in, in space and stuff like that. Maybe he'll put like, you know, vote for Dallas Runner and put a picture of him here, you know. And then down here he puts a bullet point aspect of things that he wants to uh, to to get done while he's in office. Okay, so you have and you can change the uh, the the font for this too if you'd like. Um, so you can see what you know what, what you have here. So there, there's there's elements of this also with text that you can do. Uh, subheadings, um, you'll see, and it comes comes in smaller. Um, these, if you click on these, it's it's free. So you can do this, 
and it brings in see the different uh, the two different types of um, uh, text that you can add into it. Uh, and again, if you don't like it, you hit trash. Um, you can actually add a, a new page down here if you would like. If you want to move in closer, you can bring this to full screen so you can see what it would look like. Um, um, so uh, if you wanted to we go back to, uh, you can, can add music, but what, what music do you need um, with your poster? You can add videos, but again, you what videos do you need with your poster? So the cool thing about this photo app, this photo option actually is if you come down to uploads down here on the bottom left, you can actually click on uploads. You can see I can go to my images, upload an image or video, and I can add pictures if I want to um, from here. So this is where a way you guys can maybe take a picture um, on your uh, on your computer, on your phone, or something like that. Um, maybe if you like. Uh, sitting behind a desk or something like that with a bunch of paperwork by you or you know something where you don't have to be together to work on this or you can then um, you know insert a picture of you um, or even let's say you, you guys are working you know together on this um, through through virtual means where you can then um, you know insert a picture of, let's say Justin is running for president and Veronica or whoever is running for vice president, you can put, you know, Barnes and Lily. Sounds like a uh, store. Um, uh, for, you know, for president and vice president 2020, and you can add your pictures um, in here and still be able to work on it. Now, when you're finished, um, what you can do is, is you can go to file. And you can actually save this or download it, okay, if you want to. So you can click Save to a Folder, um, Create New, and you can say uh, Campaign. <coughs> Excuse me. And now I have a I have a folder. So if you want, you can. Move now, now you move this to the folder to campaigns and you hit move. Okay, it's moving. Well, all right, it's not letting me um, move this. So let's try. Uh, you're supposed to be able to be able to move this to a folder and hit save. You have all changes saved. Um, Let's see, move to a folder, move here. It won't let me do it for some reason. Um, but you're supposed to be able to keep a folder where then you guys could possibly log in as the same person, um, under the same account possibly, um, and and be able to work on this or, or share it. Um, so if you wanted to, you could make a copy of this exact one. So now check this out. What you could probably do is take this link, right click, copy it, send it to um, the um, your, your person, people that are working with you, and um, then you guys can be able to uh, work on this together. Um, I've never tried that. Uh, we'll see. You, you can let me know if that works or not. If not, what you can do is download this. You can download it as a PDF, and now um, when you download it, it'll be downloaded to your uh, to your computer. And all you would need to do is actually um, upload that to uh, to the uh, Google Drive when you're finished with it. But uh, this is a way to you guys are able to create a a few posters possibly. Um, it's a quick and easy way to do it, so you guys can can have that. That, that ability to do this um, and to make it make it fun for posters okay uh, for the video aspect um, I talked to mr. Garrett today and uh, he still has some licensing agreements that he can use with his um, his video editor that uh, I know 11 of you are in his class um, 
some of you have used it more than others. Uh, I think he said Brooke uh, and John have used it pretty pretty extensively. Um, so he's going to add all of you guys to that. And you, from what he was explaining, is you can video yourself on Chrome, on a Chromebook, on a uh, on a, a phone, so forth and so on. And you guys are able to then um, cut the videos and and add in. So if you want to, I don't know if Nick, if, if Nate and and Nick are in a in a group and Nate is running for vice president, he puts it, you know, his little schmeal together for about 15 seconds you know, 30 seconds, and then Nick does his president wise, they might not, you guys aren't obviously going to be together. But um, you guys can can actually like video edit uh, together and, and see what what you guys, um, what you guys feel works uh, for your commercials. Again, um, remember that it doesn't have to be uh, doesn't have to be outrageous. Um, Spend some time on it when you guys like are together, um, or not together, but have time where you guys can work together. Um, creating a poster like this, uh, to be honest with you, I, I worked on this for 10 minutes. No, it's not the greatest poster, but uh, the, the good aspect of it is, is it, it doesn't take that long. So there's a good possibility where um, these last four weeks, uh, you guys can create a couple of posters, um, and maybe even if the video editing goes well, you guys can create maybe one or two, uh, uh, probably maybe two uh, commercials where the first one you put your your views out there of what you what you want to happen. Um, if you were president or vice president, um, and then I'll share all this stuff in the in the Gmail account in our classroom account. And you guys can then possibly put a poster out and maybe a 30 second uh, rebuttal to somebody, you know, um, campaign wise. Let's say you don't, you know, think America needs fa family right now. You can, you know, you can say Flager wants, Flager wants to go back to family and what we need to do is embrace our individuality, you know, so forth and so on. Um, and, and try to like do that argument back and forth. Uh, a little bit um, that they do with uh, with campaigning. Um, again, uh, I'm not asking for perfection. It's just more for you guys to have a chance to uh, to do something somewhat fun. I know none of you guys think really work is fun, but uh, sucks to be you. The school year's not over. Um, I hope this explained a little bit more of of what uh, what I want you guys to do. Um, starting next week, we'll start working on the posters, um, and we'll go from there. I'll have maybe the posters due Sunday at midnight, next Sunday at midnight, um, and then I'll share all the posters in in our uh, in the classroom so you guys can see them all, and um, then maybe give you guys like a week or two to work on the video editing aspect of it. Um, so again, have some fun with this. Don't don't look at it as uh, as work, look at it as something fun where you guys can, you guys can edit something and make it your own. All right, when I add a picture of you and your dog, uh, have at it. You know, maybe that'll be the first your 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 dog uh, planting a tree or you know, the the possibilities are endless. Um, you know, I have I have my fa a family picture there. Maybe I add a bike picture there too, where I, I say that uh, not only do we need family, but we need some cycling. Um, we need people to get back outside and enjoy themselves, get some uh, vitamin D from the sun. So, uh, again, feel free if you have questions, email me, um, and uh, I'll, I'll answer you. If, if it comes down to be where we need to have a Google Meet, I'll, I'll meet with you and, and we can talk about it, or the few of you who are uh, who are kind of uh, stuck on, on that aspect. So, um, hopefully this helps you out a little bit. Check out this canva.com. Um, it is, it's pretty easy to use. Um, all right. And I'm looking forward to seeing what you guys come up with, uh, for the posters. Um, you guys are kind of like the guinea pigs first, first people to be a part of a pandemic in the school. And, uh, this works well, maybe next year I'll have the, uh, the juniors next year create something. And then you guys can, can say who, uh, who's did the best. Um, so enjoy the weekend, uh, and I'll talk to you guys later.